like that narcissistic queen we just saw just keep on watching yeah okay so <laughs> i'm gonna start off by putting my hair up in a bun because i have a lot of hair and i'm trying to get that out of my face if you know what i mean okay let's go ahead and move on to primer <laughs> i'm gonna be using the la girl pro prep and it's not focusing and i thought it was focusing so it's fine and then we're also using the NYX Hydra Touch primer, and we're just gonna use both of those to prime my face. You know, get a nice little dewy moment. Yeah, so I'm just gonna apply that on my face, and I'm rubbing my face a lot, and that looks really weird, so I'm sorry if I'm making you uncomfortable. Now I'm doing my eyebrows. Um, yeah, that's basically that I'm using the Anastasia dip brow in taupe and then I can seal them and then I'm gonna use this clear eyebrow gel if you guys want a more in-depth tutorial go ahead and comment that down below and I'll do that for you guys so for eyeshadow I'm gonna use the Carly Bible deluxe palette by BH cosmetics and Carly Bible and it's so freaking pretty, but yeah, I'm gonna start off by priming my eyes with the Urban Decay um, Primer Potion, I think it's called. Yeah, I'm trying to use like actual eye primers from now on because, I don't know, I'm pretty sure there's a reason that they're called eye primers and not just concealer. Anyway, okay, yeah, um, just gonna rub that in and then use a light shade to set that so that way it doesn't crease and look crusty, <laughs> you know what I mean? And then I'm going to Oh, I'm still doing it. Hold on. Alright, there we go. Now I'm using this brown color. It's a nice um, caramel uh, toffee brown. I don't know. This Morphe M441 brush, I think. Don't yell at me if I'm wrong. And then I'm using this darker brown, which is a nice... Um, I don't know how would you describe this a nice kind of like my guinea pigs fur color you guys probably don't know what that looks like but yeah i'm gonna blend that farther into the crease oh this is the worst tutorial ever i'm sorry now i'm going to oh i'm doing the same thing okay i'm done blending um, let's go ahead and take this Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and we're going to cut the crease um, like I cut Friends Out of My Life and we're just going to go ahead and, you know, make a little half semicircle on my eyelid and we're going to set that with this shimmery pinkish reflective color. I should be a name maker of eyeshadows. Um, yeah, and then I'm going to do the same- oh, nope, sorry. I'm gonna darken it with that brown color. It looks like my guinea pig's fur. And then I'm gonna take a highlighter that's way too light for me. And we're gonna put that on in the inner corner and be very shocked that, uh, yep, there we go. Because it's way too light. And I'm gonna add a darker highlighter color because it's too bright. I'm adding mascara now. Um, yeah. Yeah. Then I'm putting on the biggest eyelashes that I could possibly find. Um, don't, let's not talk about it. I know they're really big, but I'm just waiting for, oh, okay. I'm waiting for it to dry so that way I can put it on my eyeball. Um, well, not on my actual eyeball, don't do that. That would really hurt. And then I'm going to take this little sponge and, oh my gosh, and, <laughs> Oh my gosh, uh, Maybelline and Milani foundation, and I'm putting that on my face. I'm also really sorry about this camera angle. It's a little too close. I got a new camera if you couldn't tell. <laughs> yeah, I'm a star on the rise, but yeah, I got a new camera, and it's like really, it's good, but it's like, I didn't know it would be this zoomed in, and I am blind, so yeah. Okay, still blending it in. Now I'm putting on under eye concealer. I love this concealer. Oh my gosh. 
never putting tape shape tape under my eyes again it's horrible um it's not horrible but it's bad for under your eyes for me <laughs> i'm gonna blend that in some maybelline age rewind concealer and let me tell you i look like an 11 year old anyway so this just made me look three um okay and then i'm gonna be taking this contour stick um oh oh i was covering a pimple with like the concealer scent end of it and yeah i'm blending that out and then i'm gonna take the other side of it and we're gonna just like contour you know just give myself a nice chiseled look yeah oh that's a straight line okay i'm using this real techniques brush um to blend it out i really like this actually blending out the cream contour it's really really nice definitely recommend 10 out of 10 um yeah now that we're looking chiseled um like my abs we're going to oh no still doing it never mind we're gonna clean underneath it a little bit with that concealer I like doing this I don't know it just looks good once you blend it out um, no I'm gonna leave it like this no I'm gonna blend it out and then I'm going to bronze I actually okay it didn't show it but I set my face first or else this would not have worked out at all this is the NYC bronzer in sunny um, and I look like I'm murdering my face like I'm pressing really hard but I'm not actually I probably am but it's okay and then I'm going to do that to the other cheek so I don't look lopsided. And then we're going to clean up underneath with a powder that I can't remember. Oh, no. Okay, I was too lazy. So I took that really white shadow from the palette and I put it underneath because I didn't feel like grabbing the powder. That's why it looks white, not translucent. So that's that. But it looks good, though, so I'm not mad about it. And then I'm going to take this blush. This is the Laura Geller blush in, I think it's called, like tropical hues yeah tropical hues we're gonna put that on my cheeks and a little bit on my nose and on my forehead because I like to even things out um and then I'm going to take this highlighter mix with this highlighter from the same palette and we're gonna highlight with this and oh my gosh this is so buttery and so pigmented like oh my gosh it's not even funny like it was Oh my gosh, yeah, it was really blinding. It's one thing to be blinding, but another thing to be like super creamy and super like dewy looking. Like some of them just look chalky and nasty, but this one looks really, really pretty. So yeah, oh, we're doing lips now. Okay, um, I'm using the ColourPop Times Square liquid lipstick. Why am I not in frame? Okay, um, yeah, Times Square lipstick, liquid lipstick, uh, ultra matte lip. I'm ADD, sorry. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna apply that, and that's it. I hope you guys enjoy this makeup look. Um, yeah. Oh my gosh, I did the same size, like, on voiceover as I'm doing on the camera. Okay, now. Okay, bye, guys. Love you. Mm. Ready, 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 ready. I miss it.